Sometimes when you get up, you don't want to get up because you're always getting up. I will know that, mate, but, but you go when ahead. I get up, I say it from the heart and I say it the way it is. I really do believe that God healed me last year from cancer. I do really believe that. And I'll take it to my grave with me. I'll take it to glory with me. Because when I was in the scene solving them along, and your woman says we're red flagging it, I was that sick, I couldn't care less. Everybody knows I had the COVID. But after I got out, now I got a word from God, and this is to give God the glory, nobody else, nothing else, because God healed me. And I remember when I was laying in that hospital bed, I had an experience with God that night, and about the sixth night, and the Holy Spirit touched me. And I believe that night that the Holy Spirit touched me, they healed me. Because God says to me about the thing in my lung, Thomas, don't worry about it. And I prayed over that for three months when I was in isolation. And then I went to the hospital, and I got an x-ray on my lung, and everything came back clear. But the marigold, that's what the marigold was. But about nine months ago, I came across a ladder in the house, and it says, it wasn't even open, and it was dated back the time I went in the hospital. It says, Thomas has been referred to as urgent, suspected cancer. Now, that ladder, I've had seen that ladder when I self-isolating. God knows where I was. But I really do believe, and I just wanted to show that. I said to my doctor, what do you think of that ladder? He says, Thomas, I can't say you had cancer, but what I can't say is when they're looking for stuff, they know what they're looking for, and whatever it was, it was serious. But he says, it's not there, and I says, praise God. Amen. Awesome. Amen. Praise God. Thank you.